Hey guys, Johnny Nerd out here. Today I wanna to talk about one of the dumbest things that I get messaged occasionally and that I overhear sometimes or that people actually think about. And that is e-bikes don't give you exercise and that they're, it's cheating. This is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Guys, I've been riding e-bikes for, I don't know, since 2015. I've been building them professionally since 2017. You certainly can use an e-bike kind of like a scooter where you're not gonna get crazy amount of exercise, but you're still gonna get exercise. No matter what, even if you try your hardest not to get exercise, you will still get exercise on an e-bike. Because if you've ever ridden a bicycle and just tried to stay upright and balance and turning, you are using a lot of muscles, just coasting. Not even, even if you're just hitting the throttle and you're just kind of going and, Turning, you're using everything. You're not, maybe not getting a crazy workout, but you are still getting blood moving more than just, I'm doing right now, just sitting on a chair. Or sitting, you know, if I'm driving, I'm using very little muscles. But if I'm riding a bike, I'm bent over, I am, I'm using a lot more muscles. But if you're gonna use it as a commuter or as, a, as an exercise bike, you could totally get just as much exercise as a traditional bike, if not more. You could burn more calories, and I'll tell you why. Because what happens for me, it's a psychological thing. If I didn't have a motorized bike, I would find excuses not to go ride my bike. I'd be like, well, I gotta go to you know, Home Depot three miles away. I'm not gonna ride my normal bike. I kinda gotta get there faster, and I don't wanna have to all day. But now that I have my e-bike, I know that I could get there in like 15 minutes and it's three miles away. So I'm gonna take my e-bike. I just burn 200 calories going there and back where I normally would not have. Or if I do wanna go for an exercise, I'm gonna be out there longer and further because I know that if I ever get really too tired, I could always throw in the towel and still get home. Where if I didn't have that option, I would probably choose to just not even go out. But now that I have that option, I could go out and go out further and longer and more often. That's the thing. If you take the average rider, not somebody who wears spandex and goes out cycling at five o'clock in the morning with a group of people, but the average person, they're gonna, over a calendar year, if they get an e-bike and they use it, they're gonna burn way more calories than they would have with a normal bike. Absolutely. I have no data or no science to back that up, but from my own experience, and the experience of others that I've known that I've built bikes for and I keep in touch with, they ride it when they normally wouldn't. So that's why that is the dumbest. If you ever hear somebody say that, it's dumb. And I'm sure I missed out a lot of reasons and a lot of more examples on why e-bikes are actually gonna get you a lot more exercise than make you fat and lazy. Literally is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I'm sorry if that offends you, but it is. All right, anyways, hopefully that helps. If you're thinking about getting an e-bike as a exercise machine, totally do it, absolutely do it. All right, don't listen to the haters, because that's all they are, they're hating. Later, guys.